Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Lots of new today. A new room. This is the new beauty studio. No, it's not done. There's a huge mess behind me, behind my shoulders, which is where I'm strategically placing myself so you don't see it. So there's that. Um, also, I'm rocking my actual hair. I finally got my hair cut. I was sick and tired of the way it looked and I'm, I'm feeling this one. I kind of like it. Anyway, today's video is going to be my current favorites. I did miss September's favorites. It's just been a heck of a month or two or three. Also a quick disclaimer, if you hear a bunch of little noises or weird stuff going on in the background, if you have not seen Jack, refer back a few videos where I feature him. Um, he's a kitten and he is in the stage of like, you know, being a tyrant and a terrorist and he really likes to cause a lot of mayhem and madness in my house. So if you hear anything, Exactly. The first product I want to talk about is by The Body Shop, and this is the Vanilla Pumpkin Hand Cream. Oh my gosh, you guys, it is so good. It absorbs really, really quickly. It doesn't leave any residue on your hands. It's not greasy, but it really moisturizes, and it lasts a good long time on my hands as far as like the moisture level. And the scent of this is just delicious. This is by the brand Time and True, and it is one of those like textured, not cabled, but like stretch beanies. You guys, I love this. This fits so comfortably. I did get it at Walmart of all places. It was only like $5 and they come in a few different colors. And I really like this because you can wear it more of a slouch, which I tend to do and leave a little bit of my hair down in the front, or you can use it as a full on beanie and it's big enough that it covers everything, but it's not so big that you look like a gnome. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, it's super cute and stylish. You can either dress it up or dress it down. It's a really good type of yarn, so it's not itchy or scratchy or anything like that. So I just am really, really enjoying this, and I think it's adorable. These are basically Ulta Beauty brand the makeup eraser. If you know what I'm talking about, there's like a cloth, a microfiber cloth that's used with just water and it removes your makeup. It's like this little mitt. It's super cute. Um, and you basically just wet it with water, warm water, and you can remove your eye makeup. And I thought it was totally gimmicky. I have been using this and you guys, it works so well. So what I tend to do is I take a pump of my makeup remover onto this pad and I will just literally like almost one swipe right off. It's amazing how well this actually takes off makeup. And these are super inexpensive. You do get a set of two and it also comes with a laundering bag which I thought was really really cool because obviously something like this is gonna get lost in the laundry get stuck in some pants somewhere you know how it works this next product you guys I have been obsessed like every aspect of that word and I hate using that word but this deserves that word I don't know what took me so long to try this you guys I don't I do not know but I did this is by Physicians Formula, and this is the Healthy Foundation with Brightening Complex. This is so good, you guys. It is buildable, I would say, to like a light to medium. Although the only thing that I would say I'm not a big fan of is the applicator because it has one of these gigantic like doe foot applicators. And I'm not really a fan of that because you are putting it on your face and then putting it back in the bottle and it's just not as sanitary. I wish this had a pump, but that aside, the finish of this foundation is stunning. I really like it. So if you guys haven't tried this out and you are into more of a natural finished light finish foundation, you need to try this out. Before we dive into the rest of the makeup, I did want to bring up a random favorite because it's just that time of year. Um, I, if you guys have picked up on it a little bit, I've been snacking as I'm filming <laughs> because I made a huge batch of pumpkin seeds. You guys, I don't know what it is about October, Halloween, but like, I think I look forward more to eating the pumpkin seeds than carving the actual pumpkins. Let me know down below in the comments if you guys would like to see me do like lifestyle videos, like vlog style where I cook or, you know, give you guys recipes or organization or cleaning or whatever. I, I've kind of toyed with the idea, but I don't know how you guys would feel about it. So let me know down below if you would like to see more of like life behind the scenes. All right, let's throw in a fail just because I'm tired of looking at it. Um, <sighs> I really like this brand. So this brand is available exclusively at Sally's. It is called Collab. So these are the Collab Micellar Makeup Removing Wipes, and it claims that it instantly removes makeup, cleanses, and moisturizes. I can't say it does any of those things. Um, it really doesn't remove makeup very well, if at all. I would highly recommend going and getting like the simple micellar water wipes or the Neutrogena. They're same price range, maybe a little bit cheaper, and they work way better. So these unfortunately were a pass for me, but there's so many out there now, I'm not, I'm not completely heartbroken over it. 
Let's talk about what's on my eyes today as far as lashes go. These were actually given to me in a swap that I did with my friend Angela over at Beauty by Angela. You've seen me talk about her before on here. We've collabed a bunch of times. And she had offered these to me and I wanted to try them out because they looked really, really pretty. Um, and these are by Baddington Lashes. And this one's in the style Monroe. These are the lashes that I'm wearing today. And I mean, can you just see the volume? They're so pretty, but they're really comfortable. They went on super, super quick, super easy. And they're just the perfect size and shape. I picked this up about a month and a half ago and I'm never going back. You guys, this product is super hyped up or was super hyped up on YouTube and it deserves every bit of hype. This is the new Too Faced Born This Way multi-use multi sculpting concealer. The formula on this is fantastic. It has one of those big doe foots similar to like the Tarte Shape Tape, um, but the coverage of this is insane. And not only that, but the finish on this is gorgeous. Highly, highly recommend. This has been a go-to for me constantly for under the eyes, for anything, carving out my brows. I mean, you name it, I've been using it for that and it's perfect. The next favorite that I wanna talk about is something that I get questions on all the time, both in videos as well as in my real life, and I'm talking about my watch. This is a watch by the brand Yord Watches. They are a wood watch company. So basically they make watches with wooden bands and wooden face plates out of sustainable exotic woods. The one that I have on in particular is a zebra wood and it is just absolutely stunning you guys these watches have an incredible attention to detail everything from the wood to the face plates to the mechanisms that you can see internally these are just so well made and the company is fantastic to work with they really truly care about their customers and they make that very very known these watches are fully automatic which means that you don't have to wind them and they don't contain a battery they literally will cause themselves to continue telling time without any assistance from you which if that's one less thing I need to work about I'm all for it I am super excited to announce that Jordan I have partnered up and we are going to be doing a giveaway for my subscribers of one of their wood watches I cannot wait to see which one of you wins this I will not be the one choosing the winner so please don't message me or try to get on my good side because I have no say in who wins Jordan is picking somebody from my subscriber list all you need to do to enter this giveaway is to make sure you're subscribed to my channel give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what your favorite part of fall is and you are automatically entered to win one of yours beautiful wood watches they do have a bunch of different styles men and women so they do have both sex watches and they are all absolutely gorgeous thank you to yord for partnering up with me and offering my subscribers one of your beautiful watches and i will continue to wear and treasure mine for the rest of my days. I will leave all of the giveaway information in the description box down below. Good luck to all of you, and if you have any other additional questions, definitely let me know and I will try to help out as much as I possibly can. I only have one eyeshadow to talk about, you guys. Like, I usually have a palette or a few different eyeshadows. I just have one this month because I've been just loving it so much. This is by Tarte, and I've talked about this before, but I've been really pulling it out um, now that it is fall, and I love warm tones in the fall. As you can see, I have very, very blue eyes, so warm tones really make my eyes just pop, and I love the way they look on my skin tone as well. This is one of the Tarte Chrome Paints Shadow Pots, and this one's in the shade Fire Dancer. This is like the richest, most delicious cranberry ever. I'm just going to show you a finger swatch really quickly. I mean, you barely have to touch it at all. Look at this. Are you serious? It looks like molten metal on my finger. It's insane. The color payoff of this is just amazing. It's so creamy. It almost feels like a cream. Duh. Um, but I mean, the coverage of this, you guys, like, can we just... Are you serious? You guys, this is just absolutely gorgeous. I apply this with either my finger or a wet brush because it just intensifies that metallic even more. But I mean... The quality of these pot shadow pots are just amazing. The last two products that I want to talk about are lip products, and one of them is from the drugstore, which is always a nice thing to have happen. This is by NYX, and this is one of their suede matte lipsticks. This is very, very full coverage. It is like a one swipe coverage. The color selection is absolutely beautiful. This one's my favorite and it's in the shade Dainty Days. It's just a really beautiful, almost like tan nude. You can see the finish on here. It's definitely a matte finish, but it is not the kind of matte that's gonna dry out your lips or cling to dry patches or anything like that. It's almost a hydrating matte, which is really, really strange to say, but it's beautiful on. It's incredibly comfortable. It lasts a really long time on the lips and they are just 
fantastic. So these I want to say are in the $8 range. I got mine at Ulta. So if you like the look of matte lips, but you don't want that drying kind of like textured cling to every little piece of skin on your lips, try these out because I think you will really, really like them. And the last product that I have is also a lipstick. This one is a liquid lipstick, however, and this is by the company Gade. Now I have a bunch of products from Gade. If you guys want to see like a review on all the things that I do have from Gade. Let me know down below in the comments if you'd like to see like an overall thing. They're more of a lesser known company, but so far I've loved a lot of the things I've tried. I haven't loved everything, but a lot of them I have. So this is one of their Velveteen Ultra Shine Lip Gels, and this one's in the shade Secret Angel. So this is more of a cooler toned, I want to say it's more of like a taupe like a brown taupe. It has the uh, doe foot applicator similar to the Smashbox uh liquid lipsticks. It smells very sweet and vanilla, very beautiful. Now these are a little bit more on the glossier side. They're not a matte lipstick. It's not going to dry down ever completely and nothing like that. But for being a glossier lipstick, this is one of the rare ones that don't travel outside of my lip lines. It doesn't bleed, it doesn't smear, it doesn't smudge. It, got, it does stay put, um, but it's definitely way more hydrating. So you can see the difference between the two finishes where this one's more of a matte and this one does have a little bit of a gloss. I wouldn't call it like a gloss glossy lipstick. It's not like the melted latex by Too Faced where it's like a vinyl on your lips. Um, it's kind of right in between a cream and a gloss, but it's very, very comfortable and the color is beautiful and so is the coverage. So I've really, really been liking this quite a bit. In fact, you can actually see that I have a window in the packaging because I've been using it so much that you can see through the packaging. I really like it. But again, let me know down below if you guys would like to have a review on more Gade products because they are a lesser known brand, but still a very, very good one. And that is it for my current favorites, you guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the description box for all the giveaway information down below. Um, in order to enter, like I said, just make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel, thumbs up this video, and comment down below what your favorite part of fall is. Also, let me know down below if you would like to see more of a vlog style video coming from me at any point in time. I would like to expand my channel a little bit, but I need to know your feedback. I treasure all of your comments and feedback very, very much. So definitely let me know what you think. Thank you guys again for watching. I love you all so much and I will talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.